Iowa State's Paul Rhodes is one of the most passionate, enthusiastic coaches in all of college football and makes no apologies for wearing his emotions square on his sleeve. Rhodes comes by his love for Iowa State honestly. He grew up about 20 miles away from campus, spent five years as a Cyclones assistant in the late 1990s. Many of Rhodes' players will tell you that the coach has left an indelible impression upon them, so much so that many have developed their own impressions of him. We are wired for sound now with head coach Paul Rhodes and the Iowa State Cyclones. Take advantage of this day to get this opportunity to its fullest. We got to have great tempo, and that's what I expect out of you. That's your challenge. All practice long, the practice has to move. We got to have great tempo. No PAT field goal. We're going right to kickoff. Get a break. Let's go to work now. Here we go. Let's go. Three, one, two, three. Coach Rhodes is all in. He's very involved. He encompasses everything that this program stands for. Practice getting squared, Tyler. You got a bad habit tackling, and you finish on the edge like this. You're just building that bad habit. Bring your hips and finish square. Uh, coach Rhodes is definitely he's an intense uh, coach, and but he's also a player's coach. Don't run with him. First part was good. You wind him good, then you got satisfied. Take him to the cornfield. Widen him. He's gonna make it make it known to whoever he's talking to that hey, I'm talking to you. Sometimes we have people that want to talk. Hayworth. Hayworth. Go, 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 go. Play hard! Get hips in there. Keep your hips in there. Keep your hips in there. Good, Vince. You got to bend your hips. Bend them. Hips, hips. Keep them under. Ah! Speed, CJ. Speed! Come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, good, 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 good. Here we go. Ready, ready. Ready, ready. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Ready, ready. Here we go. Ready, ready. I tried to hold back today. I, I didn't think I was uh, uh, very vocal at all. Real nice job of feeling it. When it goes, you steer it. You know what? I love the game. Um, I love playing it. I love practicing it. Um, I love coaching it. And I, I don't think you, you want to be around something like that and not let your, your personality out and the passion and enthusiasm that's associated with the game. I love teaching. Um, in a team meeting the other night, I talked to the kids about that. Maybe the biggest reward I get in this profession is, is teaching, 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 and seeing the light go on for a young man. Seeing, seeing a guy who couldn't do something right finally understand it and get it and have success. I love that. And, and, and whether I'm a position coach, coordinator, or now the head coach, I'm going to take advantage of that opportunity and I'm going to teach. <laughs> You get a little bit worked up just watching that, don't you? <laughs> well, it's a lot of fun. Yeah. I mean, whenever, whenever kids can, can have fun in practice, I mean, it sounds corny, but having you have a coach like that and you're actually enjoying being out there, it's a big deal. Iowa State heads to struggling Kansas this week and hosts st struggling Kansas this week, I should say, and Iowa State started 3-0 and with Steel yep. Jantz at quarterback. He got a little dinged up and turnover prone. Yep. They throw Jared Barnett, the freshman, in there. What do you see that's different? Well, I, I thought he's, he's handled himself well. I mean, he's been smart with the football. He's not creating uh, turnovers. He's not putting his team in, in bad positions. So I, I like the move that they made there. I think it gives them the ability to create, improvise. I think he's got a little stronger arm, but it also helps with James White and Jeff Woody with the ability to